And now comes the most talked about play of the series. Pinch hitter Ed Armbrister bunts. Catcher Fisk moves for the ball. His throw goes into center field. The runners move to second and third. And here comes Red Sox manager Daryl Johnson. The man ran into him in the thing. He was interfering. And you went to call it. You tell me what you were calling, man, but he did it. On a play like that. I'm telling you, the man interfered with that man on the play. I'm telling you, I want to see a man down here. Come here. Tell me that you can't help him on a play like that when he hasn't even touched the ball. And the man was interfering with him. Listen to me, there's no interference when a ball is hit and the catcher goes for the ball and a batter tries to get out of the box. And the batter tries to get out of the way. He was all over the catcher. When the batter comes out of the box after hitting the ball and the catcher makes a play, there is no interference. I'm going to tell you something. That's not the way the play went. I'll tell you that. I'll tell you one thing. I don't know what you're going to make a ruling on that, but I want you to explain exactly what you were looking at when you called the play. And the guy, the ball was hit, he was moving for the ball, and the runner was moving to first. The runner was all over the right catcher. Right there. There. I can't help that it happened right there. I'll tell you one thing, it's a lousy operation, and you and I know it right now. It's a lousy operation. Armchair umpires all over the country got in on this one, but umpire Larry Barnett's was the decision that counted. Johnson.